I don't need my beans anymore. Oh, I've got my sheep. You got your sheep. I've got my Farmer Pete hat on, and welcome to today's Farmer Pete special. I dropped some sheep. He dropped some sheep. Hold on. He's always dropping sheep. There's one. There's another one. Because Farmer Pete's story, as you'll find out in a few minutes, is all about sheep. I mean, my banana. Go on, there's the banana. Banana. Say hello to everyone, cheeky monkey. Hiya! Oh, oh dear. Oh, oh never mind. But anyway, it's lovely to see you. Welcome to day three uh, of Number Fun Live. It's day three of the school closures here in York and, and, and across the country and in lots of places around the world. So we're here to help you talented young mathematicians have loads of fun and do some super cool mathematics at home. And to play. To play. Because mathematics is everywhere. Have lots and lots of fun. Challenges. Oh, yeah, we've got lots of challenges today. We've got some videos. Loads of songs. Loads of songs. Silliness. Plenty of silliness because we just love silliness. Yeah. Shout outs. Shout Oh, yes. We've got to do some shout outs. Big shout out to Emily Norman this morning. Why? Because Emily apparently sang the Farmer Pete song because she knows it like quite, like quite a lot of you do. Um, she knows the song and she sang it to her dad who's having to stay in one of the rooms in the house. He's being quarantined. Oh, dear. But it really cheered him up apparently. So big, big. Oh, do a banana wave. Had to get me a banana. Banana wave to Emily and and to Emily's dad and his mum as well. And um, and also, hold on, another banana wave, to <laughs> the children and all the staff at St Elizabeth's in Redditch in Stockport. Because we were supposed to be there, but the schools are shut, so... We're not there. We're not there. Anyway, time for your number of the day, Cheeky Monkey. Hokey Cokey. Right, let's find the number of the day. And th we've got something different today, haven't we? Yeah. It's a... Uh, What's missing? It's a what's missing challenge. Oh, OK, go on then, have a look. Have a look at Cheeky Monkey's board. Can you see what's missing? Something's missing. So it is. Something is definitely missing. Uh, we've got bottle tops. We've got some of these five Y shapes. I really like those. We've got some cubes. A four and a three and a two and a one, actually. Oh, this is called base 10. We use that in quite a lot in school. And we've got some pegs. What's missing? Mm. Can you give me a clue? The pegs. The pegs. Pattern. Oh, pattern in the pegs. Okay. So red, grey, purple, red, grey, purple, red, grey, purple. How many? Four. No, five and four. <gasps> on the table. On the table. Hold on. Did you spot it? A peg was missing. My number of the day. What is your number of the day, Cheeky Monkey? Ten! Ten! His number of the day is ten! Why? Oh, 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 sorry. Your tea. <laughs> oh, never mind. We'll pick that up in a few minutes. The number of the day is ten today. So, Cheeky Monkey, it's time for a song. Yeah, and another shout-out. Oh, another shout-out. Because, you know, Nige, our friend who's the bus driver? Yeah. Well, his wife is called Sue, and it's her birthday today. Happy birthday, Sue! And you know what? Sue actually is my friend and we used to do quite a lot of dancing and, and the songs and videos together so i'm going to do a song with sue in today because it's her birthday the keep fit song it's the keep fit song so this is where you could do with a partner if you have a partner with you pair up and be ready to dance along should we ever go cheeky monkey yeah okay here we go here it is it's the keep fit song put a smile on your face put the twinkle in your toes put the frizz Back in your hair, oh yeah Come and sing along with the Keep Fit song And bounce high in the air Cause this is the number fun Keep Fit song Do your exercising as you sing along This is the number fun Keep Fit song Do your exercising as you sing along Walk forwards, walk backwards Walk forwards, walk backwards, walk forwards, walk backwards, and do it to the funky beat. To the left now, to the right now, to the left now, to the right now, to the left now, to the right now, and do it to the funky beat. 
Because this is the number fun Keep it song Do your exercising as you sing along This is the number fun Keep it song Do your exercising as you sing along Crawl under Walk over Crawl under Walk over Crawl under Walk over And do it to the funky beat Move closer Apart now Move closer Apart now Move closer Apart now And do it to the funky beat Cause this is the number fun Keep it song Do your exercising as you sing along This is the number fun Keep it song Do your exercising as you sing along Roll, turn, stretch, bend Roll, turn, stretch, bend Roll, turn, stretch, bend And do it to the funky beat Let's try that again Roll, turn, stretch, bend Roll, turn, stretch, bend Roll, turn, stretch, bend And do it to the funky beat Cause this is the number fun Keep it song Do your exercising as you sing along This is the number fun Keep it song Do your exercising as you sing along Everyone, I'm at the top of the stairs. Just in there is the Number Fun studio, which is really my office. Downstairs is our Number Fun office, and I've just been given a Mathematical Adventures Around the House Monster Challenge by the Number Monster. It says this, I've hidden ways of making tan. They're hiding round your house. Step by step, go down the stairs like a great big mouse. I'm going to be a mouse. Hold on. Big steps. Ready? Come with me. I'm a big mouse. Oh, I've gone down the steps. Here's the number fun office. Let's go and see if we can find... Oh, it says down here in the office, you should take a peek. Can you see the number 10, the number that you seek? Let's go and find 10 and see what we can learn. Come on, come with me. Oh, wow, I'm looking for a pen because I'm thinking I might learn some things. Right, now the office is empty because everyone's having to work from home at the minute. But this is where Lewis works and this is where Jane works. And hmm, there's number 10. Oh, have you spotted? There's always a hamster or a chicken in our videos. Hamster, oh, this is Lewis's coffee machine. Three green, two sort of ready orangey ones, and five purpley, five pinky sort of ones, purpley. Oh, five and two and three. Five and two and three, that's 10. Five, add two, add three, equals 10. Brilliant. Um, oh, there's a ruler. Oh, numbers are always on rulers. Oh look, there's a 10 on it, it's gone to 10. So that's good. So just 10 is 10, so 10 centimetres. So 10 centimetres, it's a measure. So 10 is just 10. Oh look, it's our world map up here. I've put one of these little stickers where people are tuning in and we know. We know our friend Nige, who drives the bus, lives down here in New Zealand, the other side of the world. And there's someone in Australia, Thailand, that's Dubai, people are watching from there. Emma's watching in Switzerland, and there's everyone in the UK, so England, Wales, Ireland, and Scotland, and 
Oh, there's even one over here in America. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, ten. Oh, hold on. There's blue ones. One, two, three, four. So that's four blues and one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Green. So four and six make ten. Right. Oh no! Look at Jane's desk! Someone's made a mess. Oh, I have to sort these out. Sorry about this. I have to sort them out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, ten! Nine, nine and one make ten. Nine and one make ten. Oh, I go down here in the drawer. Right. There's loads in here. It says head out past the toilet. Oh, this way. Here's the toilet. Head out past the toilet and zoom on past the sink. Open up the back door. Here's the back door. Then give us all a wink. Hey, let's see what's out here. Oh, wow, look at this. Some tiles have fallen off our roof. Or maybe the monsters sneakily placed them there. I can see five and two more so that's five and two more five six seven seven and here is three seven and three hold on hold on hold on i know what's coming make ten. Seven and three make ten i can learn that as well oh, anything else out here the monster's done oh come and look over here look at our table wooden table it's an old one. Oh, what can you see i'm seeing five big stones if you like this one's got a sneaky extra heart on it because he loves mathematics i think five big stones and five plant pots five and five make ten brilliant look at all my notes i've got loads of things i'm learning <sighs> the only thing we haven't seen yet is that Oh, it's the chicken! Because there's a hamster and a chicken in every video. He's over there! Come on, see up, come over here. Look, here's the chicken. Oh, oh not surprising, he's looking after his eggs. Oh, great, so we better take those in. He's obviously, oh, hold on. 10 eggs. <gasps> Eight brown and two white. Eight and two, make 10, that's something else to learn. Oh, eight and two make 10. So I've learned that five add two add three makes 10, that five and five make 10, six and four make 10, seven and three make 10, eight and two make 10, nine and one make 10, and the 10 centimeters on the ruler and no more makes 10. Isn't that cool? See you in a bit, bye. Well, hi, we're back in the studio. And my mic's back on. I apologize for that because I was just doing a setting here and you're, I'm not, you're, not, you're, you're muted. I muted myself. Sorry. Sorry from everyone here. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed that video. That was that was me on my adventures around the house discovering loads of things about number bonds to 10, ways of making 10. Yeah, I love it. So, and we've got, we, we've got the Farmer Pete song we're going to play for you right now. And I got a sheep pen. You've got a, a sheep pen. Well, hold on, a sheep pen is in the song. And a sheep pen is a sort of place where uh, that farmers put their sheep to keep them safe. I got a sheep pen. <laughs> You've got a sheep pen. Yeah, have a look. What here? Yeah. Hold on. I'm just going to pick out pick out one of his sheep. <laughs> oh, is a sheep pen. I got three sheep pens. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Oh well. I'm Farmer Pete, there's my hat, there's my costume when I'm acting this out in school or when I'm playing with it, but here is Farmer Pete's video. Farmer Pete, he had ten sheep. Safe and none had gone. Ten and naught makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where is my sheep? There's nine here in the pen. Nine are safe and one has gone. 
Nine add one makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's eight here in the pen. Eight are safe and two have gone. Eight add two makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's seven here in the pen. Seven are safe and three have gone. Seven add three makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's six here in the pen. Six are safe and four have gone. Six add four makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's five here in the pen. Five are safe and five have gone. Five add five makes ten. There's four here in the pen Four are safe and six have gone Four at six makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's three here in the pen Three are safe and seven have gone Three at seven makes ten. Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's two here in the pen Two are safe and eight have gone Two at eight makes ten. There's one here in the pen One is safe and nine have gone One add nine makes ten Oh dear, said Pete, where are my sheep? There's none here in the pen None are safe and ten have gone Nought add ten makes ten Oh few, said Pete, I found my sheep They're all back in the pen I found them up in the tractor shed but now they're back again. <laughs> now, my darlings, don't you do that again. I was really worried about you. I love that song. <laughs> I know. I've loved it. That was one of the first number fun songs I wrote, you know. I've, I've written over, well over 250 of them now, and that was one of the first. Well, I think it's really cool. Uh, and Tiki Mug, I'm just going to pop you down for a minute. Oh. I'll be, I'll be back in a moment. I'll oi, oi, get off! Oh, you're tickling! <laughs> Sorry, hold on. I just want to come back here to show you my abacus. Because that song... Oh, there you are. That song talks about what we call number bonds to ten. Different ways of making ten. So, in the first verse, one sheep got lost. Second verse, two sheep got lo get, were lost. By the third verse, three were lost. Then the next verse, four were lost. Next verse, five were lost. And then six were lost, and then seven were lost, and then eight were lost, and then nine were lost, and then he'd lost all ten of them before he found them. So these are what we call number bonds to ten. We've got one and nine, two and eight. Can you help me? Three and seven, four and six, five and five, six and four. Seven and three, eight and two, nine and one, ten and zero. They're all different ways of making ten. Isn't that amazing? I love the abacus for that. So let's come back over here. Oh, you're tickling. Get off. <laughs> oh, 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 crumbs. I dropped a sheep. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry about that. The chaos in here. <laughs> I love it. Right, cheeky monkey. It's time for this. Number five. Challenges. And here, Cheeky Monkey, are some of the pictures from yesterday. Oh, look at the Cheeky Monkeys. <laughs> oh, I think there's five Cheeky Monkeys on there. What do you think? <laughs> oh, this is hiding things. Oh, that's a challenge. Rosie's dog is behind the picture. Elsa's Spider-Man teddy bear, top, top of the telly. And the cone from Freddy is next to the side. Why? Oh, the Pokey. Oh, oh Edward's Russell Sprout is next to the Pokemon. It's in the basket. And on top of the car transporter. Why? Well done. Oh, I love that. Hey, the Russell Sprout. Oh, it's Maddie's birthday too. It is Maddie's birthday too. Happy birthday, Maddie. Happy birthday. Oh, and the monkey's just up behind that cake tray in the picture. Whoa. With Samuel. I think I might have spelt his name wrong. Sorry. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, well done, Maddie. Happy birthday. Hope you have a, lov oh, for a lovely day. Look at 40. Oh, I love the children at Lord Derrimore's primary school have been making 40 by doing handprints. 
ten. They've got eight, four, eight fives, mate. Forty. Jasmine, your lovely picture of forty hearts there, and oh, I love that. And Rose's picture too. I'm absolutely loving that cheeky monkey. Yeah, it's time for today's mathematical challenges. It is. And oh, first of all, Jasmine. Thank you for your picture that you sent in last minute. Here's the one you sent in last minute because the picture we just shown didn't have 40 coins on it. This one does. This one does. So I'm just going to go and pop it up on the board. Hold on. It's going over here. Over there. It's on the board. It's on the board. So we'd love you to send in more stuff to go up on our board. And here are our mathematical challenges of the day. Number one. Number one, the monster hunt. Oh, that's right. Do you remember the number but number for monster sent me downstairs to try and find number bonds to 10 with different things that he'd set up. So why don't one of you set up some different ways of seeing 10 in around the house, if you are, have got some space outside, maybe outside as well, and then send the other person on a monster hunt to see if they can actually find um, the number bonds to 10. See how you get on. I'd love to see some pictures of that. And Monster Challenge 2 is this. It, oh, that's number three. Hold on, we'll come back to number two first. Oh, no, that says number three on it. Oh, I've got number three. I've got the wrong one. Another mistake. <laughs> Another mistake. We're always making mistakes. Oh, that's meant to say, oh, oh, it is number two, but it's got, it's got the right title. Oh, dear, said Pete. That's right. Oh, dear, said Pete. I'd love you to act out Farmer Pete. And I've, there's videos online of children doing this. So... Why don't you use some of your toys to pretend to be the sheep and some and, and something, or maybe you could be the farmer. Um, if you download the, uh, let me just share the portal screen here. If you if you go to the Number Fun portal and the Farmer Pete page, you'll you'll see that. So if you type in Farmer Pete, there's the video we've just watched, and on the right hand side there's some parent notes. And when you download those, you come back to what you can see on the screen here. There's a bit of a game board there, and maybe use some coins and counters to to um, yeah, some coins and counters to, you know, play Farmer Pete. Great idea. Right. Oh, I've gone. <laughs> You've gone. I'm here. Don't panic. Don't panic. Right, is here. Right. And let's go <laughs> to Monster Challenge number three. Oh. Farmer Pete's lorry. I can't see again. Oh, yes, I can. Oh, no, I can't. Yes, I can. <laughs> Farmer Pete's lorry. I, I know some of you just love colouring. So I've put a picture here of Farmer Pete with taking his sheep back to the sheep pen on the lorry. We'd love you to colour it in and send it in. There's a teddy as well. Oh, well, that's because I've added the teddy to yesterday's download as well. So I, so I know some people just love colouring. So I've, I found a teddy picture. I bunged it on yesterday's as well. So that's that. Go do go and do some colouring. I'd love you to do that. And number fun monster challenge. Number Fun Monster Challenge 4 is about your cheeky number board, Cheeky Monkey. So let's find it. Here it is. I'm wondering whether any of you could make a number board or a number presentation about the number 10, a bit like Cheeky Monkey. So maybe it's going to show us lots of different ways we can understand 10, like it's 4 and 3 and 2 and 1. It can be arranged like that. It's 6 and 4. It can, oh, there's loads of ways. So see what you come up with. That's today's number fun monster challenges i'm loving it and yep so cheeky monkey oh let's go to the live so what what do, what do we want people to do cheeky monkey send it in send it in so this is our email address and if you can send your pictures and your messages of encouragement or whatever you want to say or maybe where you are in the world yeah i like that where you are in the world or or what you think just send anything you want to to this email address live at numberfun.com you need to look in the bag I need to look in your bag. Yeah. It's a clue for tomorrow. It's a clue. Oh, there's a clue for tomorrow. We've got loads more lined up. 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. I'd love you to come back. Can I take some sheep pens out? What, well, you can take I'll take some sheep pens out. There's one sheep pen. Oh, you chickaby, get off. <laughs> Another sheep pen. What's this? Another sheep pen. Oh, there's a sheep, but no pen. There's the pen. There's the pen. <laughs> right. Oh, what else have we got in here? We got... Oh, look. It's a... Oh. I'll hold it. Oh. It's a pattern. It's a pattern. <gasps> Maybe tomorrow's mathematics is about a pattern. We've had a pattern today, though, Cheeky Monkey, haven't we? Yeah. 10 and 0, 9 and 1, 8 and 2, 7 and 3. Oh, that's actually a number bomb pattern, and patterns are everywhere. We hope you have the most fantastic day. 
and we look forward to seeing you. Uh, anything else I need to remember? Oh yes, we got up. You know that in downstairs when I went to that number fun hunt, I saw there was a, like a world map. And on that world map, I'd love to stick a little sticker where you're watching from. So if you want to be on that wall in the country you're coming from, you're watching from, then just send us an email and we'll bung a sticker up. So I hope you enjoy your day of mathematics. There's maths everywhere around the home. And in the garden. If they've got a garden, yeah. And, and maths is just lovely. So hope you enjoy your mathematics today. Have lots of play. Do stay safe. And we look forward to seeing you tomorrow on Number Fun Live. One, two, three.